We test one, two, three. Just give me a minute, as always, setting things up. If it uh, lags today, that is because of reasons. <laughs> I set the quality pretty low, but still my internet sucks so much. Nothing I can change right now. I'm on it. Oh, my music is way too loud. Uh, how do I change this? That's way better. There we go. So this works. This works. This works. We're going to continue working on our little game here, a little horror game. The, our goal is to, to get this into uh, Markiplier's three scary games. Not in the next one, maybe one in, in a month or two. <clears throat> and I see we're losing frames. Perfect. Uh, picture quality. Is the picture quality okay? We can read stuff. It's not perfect, but it's okay. I mean, if it lags, that's okay, because we're not playing anything with a high frame rate here. Oh, that's that's okay. So, what's the status? I totally forgot what the status is. I, I worked on this for like five minutes offline and then I was like, no, we, we're going to do this together online. Mm. While streaming. What is this? I cannot, oh, I hate to see this on the side. Like on the side, I've got my little tool here that tells me the, right here. It tells me if the quality is good right now, if it's bad, and it turns red. Like every every minute, it turns red. This thing there, down there, this this little thing, and it's so ridiculous. God, freaking dang it! <laughs> I'm so annoyed by it. Like I, I hate it. Good. Here's our status. Uh, yeah, we're alone here in the woods. We can turn our flashlight. We have our cell phone that has a battery and it turns on and off and blah, blah, blah. And we've got uh, reception and all that stuff, right? That's what we've got. That's what we've got. And this is what we're going to continue with. Oh, it looks already quite nice. Uh, yeah, maybe you can already see one thing that I've added. Is you see that in the distance, it's red. Like we have this instead of just like fog, like standard fog, like like gray or blackish fog. I want to implement something that like makes you afraid to go somewhere, and it's more like a reddish tone. And it's also gonna change. Like the fog is one aspect of the game, and I just edited it very simply by oh fucking dang it! I hate to see that on the side. I need to change it. Sorry, I fucking can't do it. <laughs> I cannot push it anywhere. That's better. Now I just pushed it down. It, it's what it is. Um, so this red fog, I just added... It's pretty simple, actually. If you go in your lighting settings for the project, it's somewhere for me to stop right here. Uh, in the environment, I can just set the fog color. And I could make a rave. Basically, we could make a rave there. But I want like a reddish tone. Is that just... I don't know why, but... It, Gives me the feeling of something threatening in the distance. Could make it a little bit darker. We could make it... Ooh, that would be... Oh, this is like the wood is burning. Like the forest is burning there. Like grayish, that's the standard fog, right? But I want more reddish. A little bit darker. There you go. That's the fog I want. Uh, the second thing I added is... Actually, also pretty simple. If we have our terrain here. The terrain, I added all the uh, trees and everything to it. Like that terrain here. It's pretty dark. You can't, I can't see anything on there. Uh, let me boink us. That terrain. Right. Um, I have added something called a wind zone. If I go here to my inspector, I can add in the details in the trees. In the settings. In the settings, I can add somewhere a wind zone. Where can I add it? What if I select the tree itself? Ah, no, it was here and there on the trees itself. If I select the tree, uh, I can select a wind zone. I can create one. 
Those are the trees itself. I completely forgot where I would do it. Ah. Uh, because I did that after the stream last time, like imme right immediately after. Um, no trees prefabs. Yeah, it's in here. When you select the tree, uh, you can go there and do something, create a wind zone. And by creating a wind zone, because this is a tree thingy here, um, I've got this wind zone now. And it does the following. Uh, this one right now is just directional. Directional means it's through the hole, like everywhere. It's just directional. It's just general wind. And it makes the, the trees move. I can make it stronger. I can make it less strong. Let's see. Now it's a little bit stronger. You see like a wind zone. Those trees move and stuff. Right? And also the, the grass moves. Everything moves a little bit because it's wind. Like that's how that's what wind does, right? Um, that might be a little bit too strong here. Well, that's okay. It's still okay. I would say that's fine. Now the trees are moving a little bit. The grass is moving a little bit. Everything's moving a bit. So that's fine. I like this. I like this. So we're going to keep it. So what's the next thing? We What is this error here? I've, I never understood this error. It's just from my editor somehow. So what are we going to do next? Uh, I have no idea. <laughs> no, I want to have like uh, like different zones like that that trigger events. Like you start in your camp, for example. You are out camping in the woods. Uh, you stand up. You have nothing but your phone. Your friends are gone. The classic. The the, the classic. I love how the trees are still moving. <laughs> Because of the winds on there, even moving uh, when I'm in the editor. I hate this. I hate this so much. Why are they still moving? Let's make it not too much. That's okay. Turbulence. Oh, look at the turbulence here. Oh, that's a storm. <laughs> no, I hate this. Zero 05 was fine. Pulse magnitude. Oh, yeah, that's. Ooh, this is perfect. Yeah, that's not spooky at all. That's, I mean, it's a horror game. It should be spooky somehow, but not that spooky. That's fine. Pulse frequency. Ah, zero zero one. Same here. So let's let's make the camp. All right, we're gonna start in camp. Uh, where's the player? There is this stupid player thingy here. And there's, of course, no trees in the camp. Now it's just like we're building an environment here. We're building trees. We're building a camp. We're building a pathway that leads to different places. Stuff like this. Very simple, very basic. So we're just building now. Just fooling around a bit. So I want to get rid of the trees here in this area. Holding shift and clicking here. And there we go. That's our little camp area. Without trees, we still have gra patches of grass. Uh, maybe let's get rid of the patches of grass as well. Uh, yoink. Uh, the grass is gone now. Maybe I'll add some more grass later on, but there's no grass in this camp area. That's how it is. There's some on the outs outsides here, but not in the center. I think I'll make some on the outside here. Here we go. So, the center will also get like a, a different texture, a different ground texture because, hey, this is where. Um, oh, that's why I'm missing things. Oh, I wasn't. I was, that's interesting. Um, it should look a little bit different, right? It should look a little bit different. And I've got. Hey, I have two pop. Mexico! <laughs> hey, Mexico! Uh, maybe let's have some rock tacos. Oh, I would I would like to have some tacos, sure. So I have different layers now here. Uh, maybe we just choose some grassy ground. Let's look grass. Grass should be fine, right? Uh, that looks stupid. I can also make it not too strong. Like there's a strength I can change. Uh, opacity. 
opacity, the size as well. Okay. That was too much. The opacity basically says how strong is it. We're gonna have a camp there on a on a patch of grass. Let's see how the patch of grass looks like. How we can't see anything because it's dark, but it looks nice. It's like a patch of grass here. This is where we are gonna set camp. Love it. Uh, let's just for testing purposes, I will crank up the light. Yoink. So we can actually see what's going on even when we're playing the game. Well, the phone casts a shadow, that's funny. Didn't even realize so far. Yeah, so this is our starting area. Then there's trees, they're gonna be, there's gonna be pathways, this, and all that shit we're gonna create now. And yeah, I can say shit if I want, that's fine. Hey, Gordon, hi. Hello, everyone, yeah. There's not too many uh, yet, but it's slowly filling up, slowly filling up here. So, yeah, that's what we have, our little starting area. If now I can turn this back on. Uh, what I just saw, like, our phone has a shadow. I don't want the phone to have a shadow, so let me just turn off the phone shadow. Uh, point light, phone. Uh, yeah, it should be a prefab, that's right. But the phone has a mesh. It doesn't, it should not, it should not cast shadows. Nah, I don't want shadows on my phone here. I mean, later on, maybe, but no. You have a problem with sound? I haven't tested. Maybe? Let me see. Sound. Sound check. One, two, three. One, two, three. No? For me, it's fine. For me, it sound is fine. Like, I don't yell. Usually, I yell. Maybe, maybe that's the problem. Maybe I should yell more. <laughs> no, I don't want to really yell. <laughs> Poor neighbors. <clears throat> uh, good. So we've got the ground. And let's set up some tents, maybe. A campfire. Let's see if we can find good assets for that. Do I have any? Camp? Do I already have some in the project? I don't know what I imported. No. Fire? Fire sheet. Ooh, that's nice. I could use the fire sheet. Um, but no. Let's, let's get some assets. Asset store, let's search for some good assets. Uh, campfire. Like, we're out camping. Of course, we need a campfire. Uh, free assets, three free assets? That's okay. <gasps> campfire pack, free. Yes, that's what I want. There we go. It's it's like a low polygon. That's okay. I want low polygon. Low polygon is nice because that's... Uh, yeah, that's got to look like a nice little camp here. I mean, nothing special, nothing really good. But we're out in the woods, right? That's all we need. That's all we need. I don't want to show you my Google here. Oh, privacy update. Yeah, sure, I'll accept. Of course, I read it. Everyone should always read those upgrades of licenses and stuff like that. Uh, there we go. I've What? Ah... One problem that might that we might have this is an old set, and it's not compatible with our project. Here. It was made in twenty thirteen. Let's try. Last time I did this, I broke the whole project. So let's hope <laughs> let's let's not be stupid again. If there's a warning message, I will not I will not just accept it. I will read it. I will read it out so I won't screw up again. Because last time I broke the whole project. Let's see. Fetching all the packages. That takes quite a long time. Why does it take so long? My internet is only bad in the upload. In the download, I've got gigabit. In the upload, I have 2,000 kilobit or something. That's... That's 0.2% of what my upload is. <laughs> That's so stupid. 0.2? Yeah, it literally is 0.2. Yes, it is. 0.2%. 
in the upload. Why is this not fetching? Hello, could you fetch my packages, please? It doesn't upgrade. If it doesn't... Ah, update, I wanted to say. Uh, I have some stuff, I think. I already have some things. Blacksmith. Mm. Uh, let's search if I already have another package. That's nice. Campfire pack. That's That sounds nice. That's the one I just downloaded. Uh, Fantasy Skywalks. Flashlight. Nah. Mines. Mines might have, but it's not uh, like campfire. No. I'll take the one that I just downloaded. So if anyone is also basically copying what I'm doing and trying to learn, you can take the same. It's, it was free. Campfire. Campfire pack. Campfire pack. It is freaking old. 2013. But... I mean, I just want the assets. I don't want the fire per se. I don't want the scripts. I just want the stuff. Switch view. I don't need switch view. The rest is not old. That's good. Map. Demo scene. I don't care. Map. Oh, map. No, I don't need this. New terrain. I don't need new terrain. I'm just deactivating as much as I can uh, so I don't have conflicts because I'm using a newer version of the software. That should be fine. Particle source? Oh, it's particles. Yeah, okay. Should be fine. That should not give us any errors because I'm just importing 3D assets. Nothing like scripts, no behaviors. So we should have a campfire. We should have a model here. And now we have models. I don't want models. I want the prefabs. Oh, they didn't even make prefabs. Torch? Just torch. Yoink. Ooh, there's fire. Look at this. Look at this. We just have a fire. That's way too fast, but okay. We can change it. Oh, we've got barrels. We've got a bonfire. We've got boxes. We've got many things in this package. Ooh, tents. <laughs> that's huge. <laughs> but we're, we're going to set up camp here, so that's fine. Uh, yoink. Whoops. I pressed wrong. What button did I press? 2D. There's a button for 2D. If I press 2, it brings me to the 2D view. I don't want 2D. I want to turn this thing here. Hi, Hartox. Hello. Yoink. So we just set an up camp here. And two of those. Like we're out here with our friends in the wilds, camping. Yeah, I try to stream more regularly. You're right. It's just like, I feel like it. Because of Corona, I don't have too much work though. Uh, so, uh, not though. I don't have too much work. So I try to be a little bit more for my online community here. We are building up a nice little community, guys. We're going to go there. At least 100 million subs in the end. That's the goal. 100 million. <laughs> just imagine getting to 100 million subs. Uh, hello, mi amiga. Como esta? Que tal? And yes, I speak Spanish. And no, I don't really speak Spanish. Uh, one problem that I have right now is that our camp is not straight. Yoink. That's fine. Let's put that in the ground. Si, claro! Hablo español! <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, our camp is not straight. Uh, let's make the camp straight. Uh, smooth high. Yoink, 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 yoink. No, it should be straight. Straightish. So we've got this, we've got some tents, let's set up campfire, uh, let's put the player somewhere else. Somewhere here. We're waking up next to the uh, next to a tent here. Looking at a campfire, everything's fine. Uh, and then something happens. Ooh, that's nice. Rocks, we're gonna put some rocks somewhere here. Where's the bonfire? Right, right in the center here. <laughs> this is a Christian channel, though. Oh. <laughs> oh, we still haven't given up on the Christian channel. I see. 
You're right, definitely Christian channel. No, I'm not. I'm not pushing any religion or anything. Uh, the problem right now that I have with this is there should be no grass. Like this is a fire spot here. There's no grass, so let's change it to another uh, texture here. Size and uh, five, maybe two. Yeah, and let's let's not mossy ground. Do we have some stony ground or something? Um, there we go. Do we have dirt? No, no, no. Something like burned wood. That looks nice. Mud solo wet. No, not dry. Dry mud. Dry mud. Here we go. This one. Yoink. I mean, it's not perfect, but definitely better than what we had. And of course, we're going to put some rocks around it. Because if you make a campfire, always make sure that you put rocks around. Yeah, that's exactly what I want. <laughs> a voodoo doll. Oh, like like we have to find the dolls in the progress. We need to find things. You're right. Maybe also as what is it called? Always they they always put those things into games. What are those Easter eggs? First, let me set up a little bit of rocky ground here, so. Let's rotate those a little bit so it doesn't look too repetitive. A moon? I think the moon is already there. Don't we have a moon here? Oh, well, we don't have a moon. Um, what's really cool about Unity, I can, like, the, the moon automatically travels. Somehow, depending on the time I set in-game. Um... It automatically travels. I will show that later on. Let's first finish the little rocky area here. Uh, the rocks. Um, let's take other rocks as well. This one here. Yeah, perfect. That's what I want. Those rocks are quite big. Yoink. Yoink. I like those. They should be grayish, but okay. Yeah, we're just placing rocks right now. That's what we do. Doom 4 Easter eggs. <laughs> yeah, we're not aiming for Doom quality here. I, I, I can tell. I can say. Yeah, it's re it's a really nice feature. Like It can travel. Because I've got this directional light, which is like my moon source. And depending on how strong it is, it actually travels. I think that's just burnt wood, Hartux. It might be blood, but uh, it's not blood right now. <laughs> We might turn it to blood. Uh, do I have a globe here? Oops, wrong one. Yeah, our campfire sucks. Like, it looks like shit, but that's okay. We're not aiming for quality here, by the way. Like visual quality, I mean, we're gonna go decent quality, but not nothing good, nothing like whoa, this is nice. Just going for hmm, that's okay. <laughs> that's enough. That is definitely enough. Like hmm, that's okay. That's that's what I'm aiming for. It looks shit from below. What are we doing? We're just making a campfire right now. Man, I'm putting a lot too much effort into this campfire here. And it will still not look good. Why am I putting why am I even putting any effort into this? Here we go. Fireplace! A fireplace. Uh, uh, uh lager fire, we say. Lager fire. Campfire. I may hide a crowbar somewhere. That might be it. That's how it is. Never aim for quality. I mean, of course, aim for quality, but especially in automation, you have to go with quality. If you don't, everything's going to shit. Let's see how that looks in game. Might look nice. Yeah, look at our little campfire here. 
That looks stupid. I love it. And of course, what's missing on here is some fire, right? Some fire. I think they had this torch in here. Oh, torch. That's... Oh, I understand. Oh, yoink. Why is it rotated so silly? Why is it rotated like stupid? Oh, because of wind? Did they make wind in there? Doesn't make any sense. Does that look okay? I mean, I can change it all. Looks okay, right? We're going for okay. As I said, we're not going for... Wow, we're going for... That's okay. <laughs> it looks so bad. <laughs> I mean, it looks okay. Oh, that's not even close to being in the center. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know many of those companies, actually. <laughs> it's not just one. Uh, so that campfire, I mean, it's not nothing too much, but there we go with the campfire. With the consistent rocks around. Hey, 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 I don't have more rocks, that's the thing. I have rock number three. I can just toss one more of those on here. <laughs> there we go. We can always just, small details we can always change, that's the thing. That's why I don't really want to do that. In the beginning, let's let's have some gameplay first. Small things like this we can always do. <laughs> Pi equals three. Uh, that's not quite right, but I'll, I'll go with it. I hate that the fire goes some way, but that's okay. Uh, duration looping. I don't want it to be fast. Like right now, it's really fast. Uh, I can change all that. Let's see. Start speed. There we go. Let's. It's still burning. It's like burning out there. No, that was okay. Uh, I uh, size of a lifetime. There we go. It goes smaller. That's okay. Renderer. That's okay. Uh, what's the like duration? There we go. Why is it not playing anymore? That was okay. I don't know. We're gonna stick with it. That's fine. Pi is equal to E is equal to 3. Well, that's not okay, but I'll go with it. Sure, fine. Let's say that's correct, Rox. <laughs> so we got this little stupid campfire here. Uh, what I want to do as well with this stupid little campfire is there should be just... It sh it's not a light source right now, I think. No, it's not. Uh, so it's not a light source. I want to give it a light source. Let's just give it a light source. Just just a point light. A point light is a light in all directions. Very simple. And this should be not 10, maybe an area of 5. And the color, something reddish, something orangey. Yeah, there we go. No, a little bit more reddish. Red orangey. Maybe a little dark. Something like here-ish and that should be intensity one real time yeah that's fine it's not like going on and off like flickering like a normal light would but that's okay let's see how that will look in the end in the final game oh that looks okay look at our little campfire that looks okay i would say what's the shadows why are they oh they have shadows here right it's not perfect but there we go I have never ever used Laplace transformation. No, I only do that as a teacher. I know applications for it, but I've never really done it. If you have to do it, you you just download this. You download the tool that does it for you. Okay, we have our camp. Right? It's a nice atmosphere. You're right. I like it. Those have colliders. No, I can just walk right through them. <laughs> of course they don't. That's okay. Oh, we have full reception here in our camp. Wink. Still a little bit too bright, I would say, everything. Let's see, 0 0.05. And 
Let's see. We could make the fire like flicker a little bit, but eh, no. The red in the distance makes it really threatening. I don't know why. That's okay. Maybe our flashlight needs some more distance and strength to it. Uh, the red is just a test for later on. I will show you what it is right now uh, soon. Let me just get rid of the uh, of some stuff here. Create an empty. This is going to be a just a campfire. I just want to sort up everything right now a little bit. That goes in there. Yoink. And then I will have another thing, create empty, and that's the camp itself. Just for sorting things, I'm putting them in there. Yoink. <laughs> große Wurst. Big, <laughs> why do we need große Wurst? <laughs> Uh, yeah, the red stuff in the distance is gonna be like a game element. It's it's fog. You can't see too far. Uh, right now, of course, it's way too way too much. It's way too thick. Uh, I just have that for testing. I wanted to change in the game. Like the more you're threatened, the weaker you are, the stronger the the entity is, the thicker the fog will be. Something like this. Like if you look at this, uh, I can change the fog. Um. And I can make it thicker, I can make it less thick, and so on. I can change the color. Can, can make everything there. Uh, for testing, let's make it like this. This should be like the standard level of it. Like There should be some all the time. But it's going to change. It's going to... like Maybe maybe a bit. Yeah, like this. So it's going to change throughout the game. It's not extra thick. <laughs> it's going to be extra thick. Is that also, can I walk through here? Yeah, I can. Perfect. Flying sparks. I'm not gonna add flying sparks on here. <laughs> there's, this, there's this thing called a particle system. We could add more particles to the campfire. I don't want to add more on this. I could. Don't want to. Perfect. So we have our little camp area. Just this little, little nice camp area. Smoke signals. I want it more like a... Uh, like your reception. Like your cell phone reception that, that you've got. It tells you which direction you go. Right? Uh, so right now it's at one bar and, and I just... Like in this camp, it's gonna stay at one. And then the closer you get to your next goal, the bigger your reception. Like your your goal is to get the reception as high, and then you have a signal. You can call someone or send an SMS or something. And as soon as this is done, your reception goes down again, and then you have to find the next hotspot. Like the closer you get to your goal, the more reception you have. This is how I imagined you know how to go to the next point that you need to. Which is a different approach than usual. Usually you have like a goal or a pointer or or fog or something. I want it like this. Closer you get, the more uh, reception you have. And then when you're there, you can use your phone basically. Um, yeah. And one problem that you have is the following. You cannot have your phone on all the time. If you do this all the time, what happens? Your battery drains. So what you have to do is, of course, that's what we all do. My phone is not always on. Like, it's the screen is black almost all the time. So I don't drain battery too much. So you have to find, like, a, like, a, like a way to, like, to balance it. How many times do I use my phone in contrast to, like, like, the battery life? Stuff like this. And we already have the battery life. We can implement that pretty easy, actually. Right. So I want a button that turns it on and off. That's what a phone does. Uh, still thinking of it. Like last time, there were some ideas. Like we can have a crank cranking it up. We could find power banks. We could have separate spots where you can charge it. Uh, right now, right now, I don't think you charge it at all. 
I don't know yet. I don't know yet. But that's for later on. But I don't think you chart it at all. If it goes empty, you just die. You don't just die, but you, you don't have your phone anymore. Hell, hey, that's how it is. I don't always carry a power bank with me. And I don't always charge my phone. You wait for thunder. <laughs> you have a kite. You have a kite that flies up into the sky and you connect your phone to it using USB. Every kite nowadays has USB. And then a lightning, lightning strike hits the kite and then your phone gets charged. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you can have checkpoints. Like at a checkpoint, you charge it up by a certain percentage or something. You don't? I thought you'd die if your phone if your battery goes empty, I thought you'd die. It's not the case, really? That's interesting. Okay, so let's let's do the next. Locations. Locations. We start in our camp. I wanted the first goal. I wanted like uh we get an SMS, like our friends are out somewhere and we need to find our friends our friends if that's the monster if that's the friends i don't know yet we get an sms and um that tells us to go to the lake right because hey we're all at the lake where the fuck are you buddy and we you we need you or we want you here we're having fun and then we go to the lake and we see there but the second location i want is like a lake right it's a lake <clears throat> Replaceable lithium batteries. I haven't seen one of those like forever. But you're right, those existed. Those still exist, of course. But I hate it when Samsung did this. Uh, I always get the Galaxy phone. When I, the Galaxy S5, I think, the fifth generation, they still had like you could replace the battery. I love that feature. The newer ones, you can't replace it anymore. I always wanted to replace it. I want. I, I want to be able to at least. But no, of course, now it's waterproof, so you can't have this exchangeable. Uh, hate it. So, uh, a path. We have to make a path. And therefore, I want like a, like just a path, a pattern, like, like just drawing it on the ground from something. Like some material. That's what we need to follow. Oh, that one here. Ground rock. <laughs> hey rocks hey 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 don't you dare don't you dare go with logic here we're not going with logic this is gonna be a horror game there's no logic involved <laughs> I, I agree with you it doesn't make much sense but shut up <laughs> uh, yeah apple were the first that did this Let's see. Oh, that's way too thick. Right this way. Um, I have some nice ground textures that I could import. Uh, I want to. Let's see what else we have because I don't really like this rock. I mean, I could make it smaller. Maybe it looks nice smaller. It looks shitty. Like this, maybe? What will this look like? I don't know yet. Let's see how that looks in the game. <laughs> oh shit, it's too dark. I don't know where I, where I draw it. <laughs> I drew it. <laughs> uh, here, there. I mean, it looks okay. Don't really like it. really like it uh, let me see i think this one here even has more in their textures oh, grassy. oh those are already imported okay road ground Ooh. road ground road i mean not a road as in road no i don't like that uh, let's see i hey wait 
Yes, you did it. <laughs> SBNS, you did it. <laughs> Look what SBNS did. You see an emoji. I have one cust I could make one custom emoji on uh on what's it called? On on our uh, Twitch. And SBNS, you already found it. You have made my <laughs> you have just posted my emoji. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Sacred Sword, sure. Like, the friends here, they, they could have those names, sure. <laughs> yeah, it's a face, like, <laughs> it's a nice one, I liked it, like, my, my fiancé did it. I also liked it. Uh, it's, it's, uh, it's so fun. I, I also want to say it, but I forgot to say it. Uh, Road Ground Base, let's see. What, no, this one. No, that looks okay. That looks that looks nice. I like this. Uh, let's just see if I can find another texture for it. Another, it's too much. Capacity ten. That's way too much. Now I can draw it like this. Uh, yeah, I'm also. Uh, it's just gonna be a, like a dirt road here. You're right. From the campfire, you can basically you can already see where it goes. Where, yeah, like this, something like this. <laughs> I love it that I can see myself in the chat now. <laughs> like. <laughs> stupid! What a stupid face! Uh, love it. Uh, one problem I have right now is usually I have a shortcut for changing brushes and so, and I don't know what. Uh, how is it called? It's a package. I forgot what the package name is. Oh, it's not a package, is it? Is it a package? Uh, give me one second. Because in my other project, I have it imported, but I don't know what it's called. Because I'm missing some features that I that I have, usually. Like an advanced environment package or something. The worst thing? No idea. I don't see a lot of other teachers teaching, actually. A remote toilet, like a, sh like a hole. Just in the ground, a hole. That's what we did in the military. In the military, like like because us as human beings, we are very dirty animals. Like if it comes to the animal world, we are just dirty. Like like we have a lot of bacteria inside of ourselves. Animals eat poop. If animals eat our poop, they're gonna die. <laughs> that's that's how it is. Like like a lot of animals will die if they eat our poop, and they don't know about it. Of course they don't. Uh, that's why if you poop in the woods, be considerate. Always dig a hole, poop in the hole. Put dirt on it. You might hurt an animal. That's pure H2O, my friend. Right from the tap. I don't drink a lot of alcohol lately. I mean, I drink alcohol, but not too much. Uh, packages. What is it called? I, f I totally forgot what it's called. Oh, I have the European here. Yeah. Um... Terrain Toolbox? It's called Terrain Toolbox. Might be Terrain Toolbox. Oktoberfest, I've never been there. Be a cat, bury that shit. Yes, exactly. Uh, I've never been to the Oktoberfest. Even though I'm half Bavarian, I basically come from there. I don't... I've never been there. Uh, let's see what I have. Fetching packages. Don't fetch packages. I just want to see how that one's called. And you brekkies. No way. No, no, no. I hate that he... Like, I don't hate it that he, like, is leaving YouTube. Uh, I highly appreciate what he has done. Yeah. I'll take over from here. Yeah, Brackies, I'll take over. <laughs> they've been a they've been a team. I'm just a single person. He, they've been a team. Like, that, not really gonna happen. Uh package my assets in the project. What do I have in the project here? Just write test framework Unity U Europe? No. 
Oh, it's really an asset. Tell me it's an asset, really. I really have to search for the name now. Uh, I don't really... Yeah, that's, I'm not special. <laughs> uh, let's see. Unity Chan. We can use Unity Chan. That's one model I tried to learn uh, Unity with. Hey, Machi Mark. I can't read that, but hi. I have a beard. Like, slightly. I don't really grow it out, but I have a beard. It's not really special. Yeah, Hacktox is right. It's not really that special. Mm. Terrain tools, sample asset pack. That might be it. Terrain tools, sample asset pack. Maybe? I hope that's it. Someone remember Terrain Tools Sample Asset Pack. What's German music like? Well, we have, we've got all different kinds of German music. Uh, what I don't like, like right now, the if you listen in on the charts in Germany, there's always like in the top 10, there's always German rappers. And they're not really rappers. If you, call, if you ask me, they don't rap. They, 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 this is this mumble rap. Nowadays, it's all mumble rap. It's so disgusting. I hate that music. Ugh, it, it's not music. It's not even music. Uh, terrain tools, something. Terrain tools, simple asset. There we go. Surface is light. Ooh, nice. But the rest, like, we have some nice musicians. Uh, nothing to import. All assets from this package are already in the project. Shit. Two pack asset. Trash bin. Treasure set. Ultimate game music collection. Nice. Ah, oh, shit. I forgot what this is called. What the other tool is called. <laughs> how could I forget how the other tool is called that I want to use? Ah, oh, shit. I'm just going through all my stuff here. Nature materials. No, no. Nature starter kit? No. Industrial cabinets and shelves. I'm such a nerd. Schlager. I don't listen to a lot of Schlager, yeah. Like folk music. It happens in all countries. Uh, like this this mumble rap stuff, it happens in all the countries. And I I think it's not right. It's, I hate it. But that's how music is. Like People like it. Other people like it. So it's there for a reason. Asphalt materials. Asphalt materials? Ooh, that's nice. I don't know which... Nah, shit. I want to have that thing that I have in the other one. Like, if I go here in my other project, just look... Just... What? Come here. Like, I've got different brushes and stuff. Like, this is here. This is This is different. But I don't know how I made it different. I can't remember. Well, I just have to live with it. This is this is ugly. I know that I had it from I watched a Brecky's video actually, where I learned about terrains. Probably still doesn't still work somehow. Uh, terrain toolbox. Is it just called Terrain Toolbox? Maybe it's just Terrain Toolbox. Because that is does not exist here. Panels? Do I have a Terrain Toolbox? I don't have a Terrain Toolbox in here. Terrain. Terrain Tools. Simple as no, that's the one I have. <laughs> <clears throat> all right all right all right i give up i think but i will import this pack here azure nature it's one of my favorite packs brecky's voice is real good yeah let's import this shit here that pack i bought it's it's quite expensive actually Like, I got it on a, um, what is it called? On a sale. 
I'm just gonna use it because I like the textures. Two Germans know English? Yeah, we, almost all of us. Like, we have English starting at grade three, I think. Like, when you're 10 years old, maybe you start English, and you have it throughout almost all your school life. And then there's the internet, there's TV, there's a lot of things in English nowadays. Uh, not zombies. Atmospheric music? Yes, definitely. And atmospheric, like, like sound effects. Uh, not... May, there's definitely going to be one or two jump scares, but I don't want to rely on jump scares. Like, no, like it's not. Nowadays, those little, the small horror games, they're always just like two or three cheap, cheap, cheap jump scares. I'm not going for that. Uh, let's go uh, terrain. Let's uh, add a layer. And you see, I've got way more things now. Uh, and those are just like. Uh, Assets from the set I just downloaded, and there's some of those will be really nice paths, like this one here, for example, summer path, autumn path. It's more like our map looks more like summer, summer path. There we go. Let's see. Come on, just draw. Why are you not drawing? Oh, because I haven't selected it. Thank you. Path looks something like this now. So we can distinguish it from everything else. Maybe a bit bigger? Three? Eh, maybe two? That looks like a nice path. 3D modeler. <laughs> 3D modeler. Ah, maybe, maybe there's someone 3D modeling here. Uh, But right now, we don't need 3D models. We're just going to make a pathway here. Simple, simple path. Uh, I will just delete everything on the way there so that it's more clear to see. Like grass be gone, trees be gone, stuff like this. I'll just I'll just yeet it out, out of the window. You see, yoink, yeet, yeet, yeet. <laughs> and yes, I say yeet. I'm an old man. I am allowed to say yeet. I don't care what you say. Oh, wrong button. They, they say, oh, just go down the road and then to the lake. And there's going to be a lake here. It's not far away from our camp. There's just going to be a small, small lake here. Uh, walking effects like sounds. I will definitely add those. Uh, it's a, adding, adding sounds is not too easy, I would even say. But I'll do that later on. See, I'll, I'm adding a... <laughs> I need permission to say heat. I'm an old man. Of course I need permission. <laughs> uh, doesn't an old man... No, I'm not old. I'm not that old. I'm just kidding. Uh, but you need permission for everything nowadays, don't you? Uh, opacity 6. That should be fine. Yeah, that's fine. That's all I wanted. Great, that when I'm drawing, it actually doesn't show the trees anymore. That's not what I want. That's stupid. But okay. Sure. And this is just this pathway that leads us to the first goal here. Right. That's it. And then we have a little lake or something. We just need to follow this. <clears throat> uh, let's get rid of the stupid plants in the way as well. Should look nice. Dealer's line path. <laughs> maybe. Maybe we just... Maybe just a drug dealer is following us. I haven't decided on a monster yet or something that follows us. On the horror element. Like, we don't have horror elements yet. Let's see how that feels. I just want to test the feeling. I always test like a hundred times. Yes, kids are cringy. Yes, of course they are. All kids are cringy. Like there's this path here. 
And I just need to find the... Oh, there's the path. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's this path that actually leads us into the forest here. Horror drugs. Hey, a horror game. It Like, I would be freaking out if a, if a drug dealer would be following me around in the woods. I would be yelling. I would be running. <laughs> so maybe... Horror doesn't have to be like... That's one thing I don't get nowadays. Uh... Whenever ever, anyone talks about horror, everyone is always talking about this supernatural stuff that's going on. No, horror can come from the inside. It can be just natural things. I don't want to, like, like, I'm probably going to put a ghost in here or something. But it's not like, have you been outside and you were just feeling, you were just having this feeling that there's something out there. Uh, so, yeah... Let me just need to follow this path here. That's nice. I can just follow it. Looking into the woods. That's good. And while I get to the lake, you see my uh, thing here. My my thing here goes up. Boink. Boink, boink, boink. And then I would here I could call my friends or something. Or I could see them. I don't know yet. You got trolled. Don't get don't let yourself get trolled, man. We just need more trees. I want more trees somehow next to the way here. I'll put more. Hey, Crystal Sanchez. Hi. I totally forgot that I... I always forget that I have Twitch um, pop-ups on. <laughs> A drug dealer in the woods. Or something. Just animals or anything. Of course, horror nowadays is always is supernatural stuff but i don't i don't know yet what i'm aiming for uh, let's get rid of the grass here in this area as well <clears throat> yeah you're right the you, someone just wrote that the that the path just looks like rocks now looks strange i'm gonna paint over it for a little bit so it's not going to look like this for long. I will change it soon. So we're going to have like a lake here or something. That's too small to be a lake, but I'll make it bigger. I already touched the read button. Hmm. Yeah, watch out for trolls. Like, trolls are everywhere. Uh, so I will... Just draw over the path. Because it looks stupid right now. I want to draw over it a little bit. Just a little bit. So the strength here. is going to be less. Of the one I'm drawing. You see. And then the path. Slowly like it, it vanishes. And that's still too much. Maybe 0 0.2. That the path vanishes a little bit. That it doesn't look too stupid. You're still following it, but like it's it's there, but it's not really, really there. Am I even doing anything here? I feel like it this one here, yeah. Yeah, okay. Is anything happening? <laughs> Does anything literally anything happen? 0.4? Oh yeah, it is. A creepy exhibitionist follows you. <laughs> You're like a teenage girl, like 17, 18 years old. Oh, no, uh, no 21, of course. We gotta keep it PG. We gotta keep it legal. Uh, <laughs> just this pervert following you. See, and that stuff is real horror. It's not just jump scares. It's not just demons. It's the real horror stuff. Ah. Okay, let's see. And then also music. Like, I want music in here more. Like, there's this path, and I got now gotta, like... Where's the path? Without the flashlight, you're lost. Right now, I'm lost. I have no idea. Flashlight... Oh, yeah, this way. You see the path now? It looks nicer. Looks more natural. Like it. Freddy's toys. That's also supernatural, isn't it? 
I never really got into the story of FNAF, Five Nights at Freddy's. But I think those were also supernatural. Like, dead children or something. Oh, laughter. Oh, I love it. Like, that you just hear random laughter out of it. Which one, like, like children or, or like, deep voice laughter. Like, oh. <laughs> or, like, children <laughs> in the woods. I uh, both, I love both. Less Stony Road. That's exactly what I was aiming for. Uh, I'm going to put more trees in here so we actually have woods. Uh, I'm going to delete a lot of the woods outside. That was stupid of me to do it. In, uh, now I will just add more here. Give me, give me a second. Uh. Add bushes. Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> Let, let's do both. Let's do both. Let's add some trees and also bushes. Because I have more bushes here somewhere. Bushes. Bush. I've got the bushes out of this set. Uh, they won't fit. They won't fit the graphical approach that I have. Uh, bush 01. They're, those will fit though. And another one. And a tree, or oh, another the bush too. Deadwood, deadwood. Uh, yes, we're gonna have deadwood, but not at the beginning. It slowly builds up, and the, the wood is more dead. Like the forest is dead, everything's dead around. Uh, I want that to build up somehow. Creation brush size. I cannot plant too many trees because then PCs won't be able to handle it. Uh, I will just plant more because I want the woods to be really like... They should be woods, like you cannot really wander in them. I mean, now I'm basically planting a lot. Maybe that was too much, I don't know yet. A well? Oh, a well. And then you look into it, there's nothing in it. And you're like, yeah, that's just a well. And then something happens. Don't know yet. A well, yeah. Flowing river. I definitely want a flowing river. Yes. Some more trees right next to the path here. Oh yeah, now we're just drawing. <laughs> now it's really just drawing trees. And bushes. We need bushes. We need a lot of bushes. Yeah, that's how you say bush. Bush. Yoink. 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 I cannot take too many. The thing is... We ha if we have too many elements, of course, the PC like PCs won't be able to handle it. And it's just a cheap, simple game, so... <laughs> yeah. Don't really want to go there. I mean, that one right now is still perfectly fine. You can hide sound effects. Yeah. Yeah, that, that makes sense. But uh, with sound effects, the problem is I have to get them and download them and then use them and stuff. It's not too easy. Let's actually change the light here again to one so I can actually see something in the game. The bushes. Oh, yeah, we have bushes now. Look at the bushes. I think it's already slowing down for me even. But look at the bushes. Like, this looks nice. This is a forest. It's a thick forest. I tell you what. Yeah. I can set the render distance, which I don't really want to do. Uh, I'm just going to delete all the trees outside now. I mean... You're right. Let's just change the render distance. Uh, detail distance, 94. No, I don't need it. I don't need that too much. Tree distance. You see that changes here? B 
Billboard, I don't need a billboard. Let's see if that still looks nice. That's okay still. Yeah, and now I have way more FPS again. <clears throat> Rocks, all good ideas. The problem is I have to implement it all. <laughs> and it's it's gonna be a lot of effort to put things in here. That looks okay, right? We're, we're deep in the woods. We also have... Comp Can I walk through these? Yeah, okay, good. This is how the game looks like. Like, if you walk around, always those trees are around you and they always look around there. You're brainstorming. Brainstorming is perfect. I love it. Uh, there's, like, only so many things I can implement. It's It's got to be a very, very small game, right? You play for probably, like, 10 minutes or so? Probably 10. Maybe maybe, maybe a bit more. Uh, what? Why didn't it draw? Yeah. Draw trees. Oh, it doesn't want to draw trees. There's there's already bushes. Tree. Give me a tree here. I want a tree there. Plant a tree. You plant a tree right now there. Come on. Just give me a tree. That was too many. There we go. I just wanted one tree right there. Ah, good. That feels good. Forcing this thing to do what I want. That feels good. What I could do to restrict the player from leaving areas, I could just plant like a row of trees like this. And then I can't just, because the woods are too thick, can't go in there. Yeah, Sacred Sword, you're right. Um, but those are details. I will do the detail then in the end. Because it would change back and forth still. Making your own tool. That's a lot of... That is a lot. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Um, good. Next thing. Uh, we need to implement a lot of things now. Why are... Wait. Is my game doing this? It doesn't matter. <laughs> now that it's bright, it looks stupid. Let's actually, um, let's see. I just want to like, I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm testing a lot. I'm sorry for testing a lot. I still like, I want to, I want to test more. I want to, I want the feeling of this game to be right. Zero point one. Maybe some bushes in the camp. What's looking kind of thick? Okay, that's okay here. Of course, we are very responsible and we leave the campfire on. How responsible of us? I hold down shift all the time in order to run. But there's no running, I know it. <laughs> because I made the game so far. There's no running, but I, let's implement running. Let's implement running. Because every game has to have a running feature. Uh, player look, player controls. There we go. Player controls. If we hold... That's empty. Nice. Love it. Ah, uh, oh, a key that toggles night mode. I could do that. Like, just a button. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, but I don't... Uh, I'm way too lazy now. Mm. Nah, I mean, we're just sliding a slider. That's easy enough. <laughs> Everything there is looking thick now. Uh, update. Uh, what did I want to do? If the key is pressed. If... Key down. Wait, no. Key uh, blah, blah, blah. down. 
aqui. Input. Whoops. Input dot get key. Returns true while the user holds down the key identified by the specific key code in non parameter. Yes. Uh, now we need a key code, and that key code is, of course, shift. Left shift. There we go. Uh, there we go. Got this going for us. And now. Um, and now. My brain is also simple. Now we have the player move here. Right? Now we have the player move. And I need to change something in this player move script. So I need to actually import it here. Uh, public player move script. Uh, move script. And there, if we hold down the shift key, then player speed. Whoops. Move script dot player speed goes up to uh, I will just also add something in the move script here. We have two speeds. We have a quick one and we have a we have a player speed and player speed move. Uh, no, walk. Let's call this one walk. And we have a player speed jog. And we will have a player speed run. We will have different levels. That's six and that's maybe ten. That's really fast. Very simple. Keep those codes away. One minute, one minute. I'm almost done. <clears throat> And the last one is I want player speed current. And the current one, that one is private. No, it's public actually. Uh, but we can also do this height and inspector because I don't want to change it from my editor here. Uh, in the beginning, we actually, whoops. Right in the beginning, we actually say that the current speed is the walk speed. And from then on, we will just use the current speed instead of the walk speed. And that we can change now in the other behavior. So there we go. Player controls, smooth script, player speed. Current is player speed. Move script. Uh, it's player speed. Jog. Uh, else. Uh, the same thing, but we don't want the player speed to jog. We want the player speed to walk. If you don't hold shift. Trees go, ah! Running use more battery. Mm. Yeah, something like this. Definitely running has like costs you something. We'll see about what that is later on. Or it will make a sound like you're loud and something hears you. Gee, that attacks you. Yeah, something like this. Like if you, I want it actually, if you hold your phone on it, I actually want to have like a photo mode. If you go in photo mode, um, the uh, the thing that follows you, it just disappears if you go to photo mode. The problem with photo mode, a lot of battery usage, right? A lot of battery usage. So that's good. That's what we have. Uh, we should be able to run now. I mean, it's just twice the speed. It, it is not really fast, fast, but wrong way around. Did anything happen? Did anything happen? <laughs> uh, let's actually not hide this in the inspector. Let's see this. So we see the current speed right now, top right. We see how fast our character is moving right here. Let's see, I can, oh, shift one. 
Object reference is not set to an instance of an object. Play control. Oh, of course. How about idiot? This needs to go here. It needs to be linked. It wasn't linked. That's why it didn't work. Let's see. Slow, fast. Look at me running. Yeehaw! That's fast. Probably too fast, but we'll do it in the beginning. Right? We can change those parameters now easily. Uh, and I also want to get this back. Thank you. How did I learn programming? Uh, some parts in school, most parts just watching YouTube videos and trying things on my own. That's how you learn. Just, just do it. That's the thing. I just do it. Let's actually put... Look at this. If I put the jog speed now to 20 or something, <laughs> that's going to be funny. I just walk, 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 and then I just, I see something. Ah! <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, nothing's going to ever get us. <laughs> I'm at the end of the map almost. I'm just going to go down. I'll be running there. I am speed. I'm so fast. <laughs> I'm flying. Oh, no. I don't have gravity in this. Oh, I have to add gravity somehow. Shit. I'm flying. There's the map. Bye-bye, map. <laughs> oh, my reception goes up now. I'm outside this map. Oh, strange. Yeah, that's too fast. 20 is too fast. Let's let's say 6. Uh, whoops. <laughs> this is a Sonic game. Oh, yeah, it is. Hell yeah. Uh, lake. So this area is going to be some a uh, lake. Uh, to making a lake, I need to lower the terrain here, and then I need to put water in it. Uh, uh, let's see. Let's lower this terrain here. Let's make it something like this. Okay, wait a second. We're watching a Brecky's video now. Because I need, I want that stuff that I have. Uh, Brecky's Terrain. No, no, no. Shut up, Brecky's. That's not it. That's not the stuff I want. Create a forest in Unity 2018 in under two hours. That's what I did. Thank you. Uh, not a good one, but still. Oh, how to make terrain in Unity. Yeah, there we go. Hey, Brecky's. Hi, how are you? I'm taking over from here. Thank you. Oh yeah, he has already this advanced thing, so it has to be before here. And help bezahlte Werbung? So there's advertisements in here. Okay, Brackies, which tools did you download, please? Brackies, tell me. Drain tool sample asset. That's the one I have. Drain tools. Drain tool sample asset. Those are the things I have. Brackies, are you kidding me? That's the stuff I imported. That's the stuff I imported. I hate this. <laughs> I hate this. Why is it not the stuff I have? Why is it different? Let me check again. <clears throat> Terrain. Yes, yeah, search for it, please. Update. Sample asset pack, yeah. Terrain. Filters. What? Just give me, just give me my... They changed a lot also in Unity. Like, Brecky's tutorials, they're already... They're not old. It's one year or so, but they're already old if it comes to programming. Like, one year is a lot. And, and software and tools and stuff. No, I don't want this. I don't... Why is it not showing anything here? Filters? Clear filters. Load next. Yeah, I want to... 
Why does it not work? Oh, terrain. I, I have terrain on. Maybe we make a lake and then we need to follow a river afterwards. Terrain tools, sample asset pack. Import. That didn't work earlier. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Maybe it works this time. Yes, perfect. All assets from this packet are already in your project. Timeline, no. Unity distribution, no. Where's terrain? Give me text mesh pro. No, 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 no. Input system, no, 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 no. Do you know that feeling when you know, ah, oh, it's somewhere, but you don't know where it is in project? No. Build in. Terrain physics, no, terrain system is already in there. Other project, let's see. Package manager. You know? To these sprites, no, 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 jet point, no, 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 I don't care about this. Train tools. Why does this one here say preview? Why does this one say preview? Why? Train, why does this one? Why? Where is it? What? 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 Oh, <laughs> it's gone. It's just not there. It's just not there. It's rain. Maybe. No, it was version 3. Point something. Okay, this is confusing. Why? I will take care of it later on. Yeah, my life is being drained. That's not good. That's bad. Let's see. I need to lower it manually then. Hey, perfect. That's what I wanted to do. This is not annoying at all. So we're just gonna make a little lake here. Yoink, yoink, yoink. So I'm just lowering the terrain right now. And then we're gonna put in some water. And by water, it's, it's, you don't really have water to fill things. It's not like real water that we can add here. Uh, I have to create an object and give it something called a water shader. I don't even know if I have one. That's the, that's the lowest I can go here, really? Very shitty, but okay. So, uh, I will have to make a box and then give it a water shader. 3D, uh, cube. Cube? No, a plane actually would be nicer. <gasps> no, let's make it a plane. This is gonna be our lake. Something like this. And then they tell us, hey, go go to the lake, and that's your first quest. Looks like water. <laughs> yeah, perfect. That's water how I know it. You are completely correct. I forgot that this is what water looks like. I think I already have one water shader now imported with the other system there. I think I already have one. There we go. That's a water shader right there. Your phone battery is dead. Ah, oh, bye, Gordon. <laughs> phone battery is dead. Interesting. 
Let's see. Yeah, you're right. I can walk on it. Uh, but I want to make it like a barrier anyway so that you cannot go in onto the water. Or even into the water. Should be no way. Why did that... Oh, they are always... Oh, okay, that's what it is for now. Uh, so there's the lake. That even looks nice with the... Uh, with the moonlight on it. You see that? With the moonlight. That looks okay. That looks fine. Uh, just one thing I need to add. Somehow I need to add gravity to my player character here. Yeah, the water, because I have it from the set I bought and it's really good looking. I could use another one, but that's fine. A like and jump scare initiate. <laughs> we'll see about that. Um, I just need to create some gravity and I will just have a passive gravity always acting. It's not Unreal Engine. No, definitely not. No. That Unity can look very good. It can almost look the same as... Um, what's it called? Uh, brr, uh, brr, uh, mm, mm, the thing. Unreal. Yeah, it can almost look as nice as Unreal. Uh, Z float Y. Uh, oh no, it's an axis. It's ah oh, shit. Uh, the it's not a float. Oh no, it's a float. And so it's negative 0 0.1 because it's gravity acting down. And then I need to just multiply this here. Uh, at the, the 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 what's it called the the gravity on here. Let's see. Uh, mm, transform dot up times y. And now we should have some gravity. I hope we have gravity. Hey, TTV, HQRS, twenty four eleven games. <laughs> that's a, that's 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 a long name. Uh, maybe we also fall through the ground. No, I don't know yet. Should have gravity, I think. Yeah. You see it? We settled down a little bit. One problem you might have, the gravity is not strong enough. So if I go down here. What is the gravity? We'll see. <laughs> I think his, his, his kid actually, it, the, the name itself is kind of normal. It's just like the letters and stuff. I think it's just Kyle or something. Uh, hard looks not much. <laughs> I just realized that we need gravity acting on us. And you see our character, like, there's gravity acting on it slowly. You see it? It's like... <sighs> slowly falling. The last 15 minutes, I was just complaining that I can't find the... A package that I used to use. Uh, let's actually make the gravity act way stronger, like, one. Why can't I move in the air? We're not gonna be ever in the air. This was just... I just wrote it so that we are bound to the ground. Uh, whoops, wrong button there. So now we're basically always on the ground, which we weren't before. And before we were hovering around a little bit. And now we're always on the ground. Which, which makes sense, because we're not a flying ghost thingy. The bushes look stupid. They're either on or off completely. I have to change it somehow. I don't know how, but somehow. Smashed by gravity. That would be unfortunate. Yeah, so I can go up and down now. You see this? I can go up and down slopes. I couldn't do that before. The problem is I can't jump now. <laughs> I cannot get out. Hmm. Okay. Good. Next thing. Uh, 
I watched with the with the last Jackbox. Yeah, I, but I didn't really like the newest pack. I gotta say, it was nice, but I didn't really like it. It was nice hanging out with you guys and playing the game, but the game itself. Hmm. I like Jackbox Six more. Let's see. That's so. That's the lake. Um, I could do a couple of things. It's this navigation. I could make an agent. Um, that will make this area not walkable. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, TTV. I will just call you TTV. Will I make a lake monster? A lake monster? Mm, no. Uh, but I want... My friends should be here somewhere. There should be a lake monster. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Now we have this location. Let's keep it... Let's let's first create the locations and then we see what we put in there. Right? So we've got this lake. Right? We've got this lake. And I would say from the lake we need to go back to the camp maybe. And then something happens there. Let's see. Just I don't want jump scares too early. No, I don't want <laughs> look at look at <laughs> look at my little character. That looks so cool. <laughs> yeah, a small ruined wooden building. I like that. You are a ghost followed by stupid teenagers. I like it. <laughs> uh, I like this. That's why they're always screaming. When they see you, they run away and they always scream at you like, What is there? Is there something? Is there something here? What is it? Just... <laughs> and it's you. It's, it has been you all the time. <laughs> the music gets all intense and stuff. Planet Coast, I've played it, yeah. Maybe. Maybe. I, I haven't played it too long. There's still stuff going on. Uh, there's still stuff to explore in Planet. Uh coaster for me uh let's see so uh but first i want to imp improve this uh there we go it's a nice plot i like the plot actually yeah you're right <laughs> sounds funny though uh let, let me just make the the area here around the lake a little bit different Pest zero four yeah select something uh mod that's too weak <sighs> i need my other tools so silly <laughs> yeet why why do we eat why did we eat Just brush the lake a little bit here. Yeah, the lake looks nice. I think so as well. It's just a little stupid lake. And nothing is happening yet. The game still hasn't content. <laughs> bridge leading a bit into the lake. A little bridge. That's nice. Like, uh, what are those called? They have a name. They're not called bridges. They're called... They have a name. And I have some. I will, I will add those. Yeah, that's a good idea. I have those somewhere. I already had them. Uh, in my assets. Somewhere I bought one of those packages that has those. There. This? No, that's not it. A shul tool shed? A dock? Is it called? A pier. It's called a pier. Yeah. A pier. That's what I want. In some package, I have too many packages already. Yeah, fantasy game, fantasy set, add to, add to, no. It's gonna take a minute. Ooh, a spider. Should we add a spider? I've got those spiders. Or a dock, a dock as well, yeah. Blacksmith. I already had those. I think it was in the bridges packet there. Or in here? Like one of those bridges here? I think so. Let, let's add those bridges. Yeah, a meadow. Like a little clearing, yeah. 
Giant spider. <laughs> uh, that's wood bridges, like stairs, bridges, I think. You can build like a little bridge thingy out of this. Little wooden one. Wood bridge. There's even things called wood bridges. Yeah, I'll take it. I bought those packages. Like this package probably cost me like a buck or something. So I'll use it if I can. <laughs> uh, wood stuff. Lexor assets, yeah. Uh, materials, prefabs with collision, yes. Something like this. So yeah, this leading into the lake. Bigger yoink. It feels like trivia night. Uh, something like this. But it needs like... <laughs> it needs to be connected to something, I would say. Do we have, like, wooden poles or something? No. This doesn't have wooden poles. Wooden beam. Wood beam? Yeah. <laughs> With my meme face? I don't have a meme face. What do you mean? Piranhas. You just jump in the lake and you did. <laughs> that looks dangerous here. That looks just dangerous. Uh, let me check the other my my other like because I have assets in here and I know I know which one I'm searching for like stuff like this here I'm searching for a deck like something like this I want in there this looks nice uh how did I in which pack do I have this deck 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 Is that the, yeah that one which asset in where are you Wood set pieces. Wood set pieces. I want those. Back in a bit. Yeah, I'll still be here for some time. Uh, just one second. I don't like this wood bridge. Let's get the other thing uh, here. Wood set pieces or something. Uh, hi, Tekovia. What is this stuff for? <laughs> uh, we're just making a horror game. A little, little horror game here. And I'm using uh, Unity. It's called Unity. What set pieces? That was it, right? Yeah, what set pieces? I'm just re-importing old things that I had in other projects. Credit goes to the guys that made those. I have no idea who made those, but credit goes to those, to this here. I will credit them when credits do, but I bought those, so I do I have to credit them if I bought them? I don't think so. My money is enough credit for you. I think so. Eternal Echoes at Entertainment. So, uh, here we go. Hurry up, please. Pillars, there we go. Boink. Deck. There, we've got this now. And that goes right here. Yoink. Yoink. A nice wooden deck leading into the lake. Uh, one problem that we might have, we cannot really go on there. Hey, David. Hi. Uh, we need to have, like, a clear path here because we freaking can't jump. I mean, I could make it jumpable, but not yet. I don't want jumping. I don't know why, but I don't want jumping. So I will just make this go up a little bit. It's way too big. Ooh, that looks ugly, but okay. Wooden stairs? I don't want stairs on here. Uh, smooth. Smooth that. Why doesn't it smooth that? That should be enough. That should work. <clears throat> now it still looks stupid because it's floating around. Not gonna happen. I don't want floating shit. Uh, I wanna just make those longer. <laughs> I'm gonna cheat here a little bit. I'm just gonna make those longer. Uh, yoink. Yoink. 
No one needs to know that they are not really this long. Don't tell anyone. <laughs> Yoink, they need a little bit longer. There we go. I uh, actually want to get rid of this one here. The prefab. Now that's open here. So we have this little deck that goes in there. Look at this looks nice, doesn't it? So we start here in our area, then we have an SMS basically telling us, hey, go to the leg. And then we're like, okay. And now I'm going there. I'm almost there. Almost, almost there. Well, the leg is too far away. No, it's not. Don't stop telling me it's too far away. It is. I know, but not really. And there's our wooden deck. Look at uh, the reflection. What was that graphical glitch there? Can I go on here? It doesn't have a collider. Look at this. <laughs> a small fire lamp. Oh, yeah, of course. Our friends are here. We need to. Uh, one problem that I just saw is that this whole thing, I can't walk through it. Uh, I will just give all of these elements here something called a collider. That might be... Ah, uh, shit. That, that is shit for the performance, but who cares? I'll get a collider. Player speed jog. I will make the jog speed right now a little bit faster so we can actually test more. Because the area is already quite far away. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Zoom, zoom, zoom. <laughs> Love it. So, can I go in here? Can I go through it? I can't go through it. Why can't I go through it? Oh, because I, yeah, I... I can't, but I also can't. Strange. But yeah, that looks nice. I can't walk through. Sometimes I can, sometimes I can't. I know why. That's annoying. Ugh. Uh, I know why. Come here, come here. Yeah, give me a minute. Guess who's back? Back again. Shady's back. Tell a friend. I don't want those box colliders. I will just create, I will just redraw this thing and give it its own colliders. It's silly, but it's way better for the performance. Uh, just bear with me for a minute here. Add component, box collider, edit collider. Where is it? Where is the collider? Should there? Why did it spawn here? Uh, yeah. Give me a minute. Because now I'm, I'm basically rebuilding this whole thing just in a 3d way uh with so-called colliders this is and we cannot pass those and we ca i cannot go up there right that's how you do it you just add colliders uh, another one uh probably it would be better if i just first Ooh, that's stupid but okay uh yoink <clears throat> now this is gonna take a minute. Whoops. Uh, especially if I misclick. Ah, I did a mistake. Uh, uh, it's okay. Ah, this this is gonna annoy me so much. To create those is gonna annoy me so much, I'm sorry. I will just yell for the next 10 minutes or so, and you will, you have to stick with me. <laughs> uh, that's how it is. I'm sorry. Wait, how do I say? Usually you say sorry, not sorry, right? I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. SMS? Sorry. 
sometimes sometimes I hit my mic. Do I? Sorry if I hit my mic. No, I don't really, not really carefully. Those are just the areas I cannot walk into. Like those are, those are restricting me where I can go. I have to do those because the deck is several elements. I don't know why they made it separate, separate elements, but that's just what it is. Just need two more, three more. And I'm not doing it careful at all. Like, not really. And just this one here and then the ground so that I can't fall through. Yoink, yoink. Almost done. We're almost done here. Yoinkus, doinkus. And two more for the ground here. <clears throat> I think the ground ones are the ones I need to uh, take most care of. Eh, wrong button. I'm press I'm keep pressing the wrong button. Don't keep the ideas back, it's fine. A broken boat. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is I need the 3D models for it, right? That's 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 like if I want to add a broken boat, I need a broken boat and I don't have one. Add one more collider. That's a lot of colliders. They're very bad for the performance. Uh but it's just 10 or so, so that's fine. Oh my god, I don't know which one is which. This one here? Yeah. Okay. Nope, wrong one. Wrong one? God damn it. They're still visible? I thought they would go. No, they would be invisible if I do this. No. Okay, okay, that's good. And this here. That is almost good. So now we have this deck working and I cannot walk into it anymore and stuff. I should not be able to. Let's see. Let's see if this is the case. Uh, let's make more light so I can actually see when I test things. <clears throat> Yoink. Woo! <laughs> let's imagine a horror game and you go like this. <laughs> I don't know where I am anymore. There. Where is my wooden deck? Where is the lake? Guys, I lost the lake. <laughs> no idea where it is anymore. I have to restart. Uh, back to the lake. I'm, I'm moving a little bit too fast, I would even say. So I should not be able to walk through it anymore. Yeah, I'm not. Not able to go into it anymore. Uh, except for here because I left it open. Yeah, and I can walk on it. That's okay. And I can still go, yeet, yoink. 
I mean, we're clipping into things, but that's okay. Clipping into things, not too bad. Kind of works. And kind of works is the best kind of working. <laughs> Uh, it kind of works. That's fine. Hmm. Good. So. Works nicely. It's fine. Not perfect, but it's okay. So there are the like, and you said there, we could put like a little fire or something like a torch. Maybe a torch. Yeah, we walk on water. You're right. Uh, I also will make like a collider here so that you cannot go into the lake. Uh, which brings me to one thing. You're right. Ooh. I actually want to have one more so we cannot go into the lake from here. That's a lot of colliders here. You can go on the deck. There's going to be something on the deck, but you cannot go into the lake from it. At least you're not supposed to. Good. Hi, AI. <laughs> And let's add some kind of lantern here or something. Do I have one already? Lantern. Nah. But I want a lantern. We're camping. We're out camping. Do I want a smartphone that shines here or something? Uh, no. Let's see if we can find a lantern. Free? 3D? Hey! It's Halloween. Uh, lantern, fire, lamp. Maybe lamp was better. This won't help. Something like this. Because our friends, like, they're out in the woods. So they, they also, we are out in the woods. How would you, when you're camping, how do you light, like, how do you make light when you go swimming in the middle of the night? A lantern would be nice. Old lamp? No. Magic lamp, that would be funny. Like a light that shines around, that makes an area. Modular medieval lanterns. Those look kind of okay, I think. Those down here? Would you bring something? You don't bring something like this to your camping trip. Flammenwerfer. <laughs> <laughs> flamethrower? Does that exist? That's probably not free. Ah, that's even free. <laughs> no flamethrower effects. I want the flamethrower from the boring company from good old Elon Musk. So, uh, no, that didn't work. Maybe I already have something. Let's let let's get back into my packages here. Uh, wooden pieces, wooden barricades. No tools. <gasps> Wait. The lantern could be hanging from... But you, you wouldn't bring such a lantern. That's the thing. If you go out camping... I want some realism here. I want some realism. <laughs> At least some. Uh, no, what I want is actually this. They have a torch. No, wait, no wrong one. Torch.
Well, that's something like this. Like a modular torch. Like they just they just got fire from the campfire. They lit a stick on fire. That's what it is. That's what it is. And it's called a... What did I just call it? Torch. Instant sun of pocket. Yeah, that's what I want. <laughs> hey, 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 I make the rules. <laughs> uh, torch. Simple torch. Perfect. That's what I want. Look at this. A very simple, easy torch. I mean, I just I basically just want a burning branch, but okay. Lightsaber. Possible incompatibility. Use a Unity 3. Ah, sure, why not? I don't care. What's it called? Simple Torch? Simple Torch. I'm using the oldest things I can find, probably. Torch. You know what a torch is? A torch is just a... It's just a branch. It's just wood. They just lit wood on fire. <laughs> it's just burning wood. Make a backup. Yeah, we've been there. We've been there. You're right. You're right. Torch slider. No, 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 no. Scripts. Maybe it's gonna work. Uh... This shouldn't change anything. Uh, no thanks. I just clicked no thanks, so it didn't import it. Hopefully. Why? Wait, no, I didn't. It didn't make changes to my settings. Good. So I won't. I want to get rid of it again. There. Torch. Fuck off, torch. We're good again. <sighs> Fucking torch. Who makes it? How would you? How would you make lights when you're on the like? I would just put a freaking smartphone here. Uh, just give me a second. Uh, I would just. Put a smartphone here. That's the thing. Oh, I got it. I, mm, here's here's the thing. We find a smartphone of one of our friends here. Flashlight is on. It's just shining there. You can see the screen. It's just there. You can't find your friends. And that's the one that sent you the SMS to come to the lake. And you just find the phone there. Yeah. I'll just do that. I don't care at all. Uh, phone. 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 And you just find the smartphone. And then you go to the next one. And then you find the next one. And then the next one. And the next one. And so on and so on. Now we need a corpse. I don't want corpses in there some Yet. Smartphone, there we go. Uh, I will make another zone here that's called the lake. We have the camp and we have the lake. Which is not really a lake, it's very small, but that's okay. Uh, plane, that's the water. And the deck also goes into the lake. Of course, the battery on the phone, the, the phone dies. When you find it, the phone dies. That's the corpse you find. Like, the phone dies, that's the corpse. I'll just put it... Wait, where is it? Where is the phone? There? It's there? That's zero, 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 zero? Ugh. Ugh, go there. Yoink. Now it's in the middle of the lake. Oh yeah, it's just floating around somewhere. 
It's just on this deck. <laughs> Your phone is dead and that one is still alive. Oh, that would be nice. So I just need to place it here somehow. Uh, let's make it bigger. Should it be bigger? Does it look stupid if it's bigger? I don't know, actually. Uh, smartphone, uh, blah, 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 size. Mm -hmm. Oh, transform. I was looking for the transform. Ah, it doesn't have a transform. That's impossible. I mean, now it's probably too big. But no, that's still fine. Phones nowadays, they are huge. Like, it's right here. And then you find it, and then... That's it. I don't know what happens next. But that's the plot so far. You find you find a phone. Hey, that's what it, that's how it is, yeah. It it could be a tablet as well, as well, you're right. Um the smartphone only needs one thing, it needs this light again. So I'm going to put a light here. And it's a point light this time that lights up the whole area here. Uh, give me the directional light. Hey, you see this? Sm oh, that looks already nice. See that in the distance there? Lights up too much. Maybe it's 16 or something. I see it shining around here. Yeah, that's nice. And it's gonna generate hot shadows. Yeah. Yeah, that looks nice. Uh, the only thing I want this one here to do as well is this material here. Oh, it has an emission. What does that? That's good. Let's see how that feels like. I'm having too much fun making this. Look at this. We have a camp. We have the lake now. Let me just run there. And then on. Oh, look at this. We have this reflection there on the deck. See it? The reflection on the deck. Whoops. I was just running. Whoops. 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 Where, where was I? Here. And then you see you come here and then you see like, oh, that's, that's strange. And there's the smartphone. Why is the smartphone here? And you pick it up and you explode. That's the game. Boom! <laughs> that was so funny. No, it goes somewhere where you can see it from the distance. Let's scooch this over. Here. I can see it lying here. Whoever the fuck left, left his phone here, but that's just what it is. Maybe the intensity can go up. Just a little bit. Range can go down, but intensity goes up. Let's see. I, I just... I need to look and feel. I need, I need to see it. Oh yeah, you're approaching it, and then you already see it from the distance. You already see it from far away. Like, that's the phone there. That's There's something here. Oh, that's strange. Let's go there. And while you go here, while you're here, like, the, the your, your uh, thing here goes up. Like, boink, boink, boink. And then you're here, like... And when you go here, like, when you get close, the phone just dies. It just dies. Like, you approach it and it dies. It just dies. It's just like, whoosh. Uh, let's add the script for it. So script, uh, yoink. I'll call it yoink. No, uh, smart, uh, phone, uh, phone deck. Oh, phone lake.
I'm just thinking uh, we could have triggers. We could do a couple of things how to turns off just by being far away. Or we could like as soon as we enter this area here, probably. Yeah. Let's add another component, which is a collider. Just a sphere collider. A sphere collider, yeah. Let's say this is bigger here. No, that's stupid. Center radius, yeah, yoink. So if you get close, if you get into this range, it just turns off. Bigger. Yeah, that's okay. So this thing needs a, a light as an input. The phone should be bright so you can see it from far away. L we'll test it. Those are the details. We can easily change. Um, public light. Can I have a light? Yeah. Uh, phone light. Uh, now we ha can do the following. We can use something called collide uh, collisions. Uh, and on collision enter, I think. Yeah, on collision enter. Yeah, on collision enter. We could... On trigger enter. There's collisions and there's triggers, right? There's triggers and collisions. Uh, and a trigger is just a collision you have to detect by, like, right now this is a collider. This is a collider and you cannot enter it because it's an area. Let's, like, if I make it a trigger, you can enter it. It's just, like, for the game. So let's have it a trigger. And we need to do one thing. The player right now is an element. And this element right now, uh, let's say, actually layer and everything below it uh, all of those will get a tag we get tags and those tags are um, gonna serve because the phone only turns off if the player enters right uh, player character let's call it player character actually because player already exists and I don't know what it does player character and all of these will get the player character tag So if the player character gets into this area here, the phone light turns off. Or maybe it starts to flicker and then it turns off. Maybe it flickers and then it turns off. I'll think about it. Uh. <laughs> you search for your friend's smartphones. <laughs> they're just idiots. They just lost it. No, they are gone. Your friends are gone. And the smartphones, they're just... This is just one smartphone. I don't want to like many smartphones or something. This is just the first model. You find it and you're like, what the fuck? So now what we need is the following in this script. We need to see on Collider on... We need to see if the other one uh, has a tag and that tag is player character. Uh, player character? Did I say? Did I do this or something? How did I? How did I do this? Uh, player character. Yes. Then uh, phone light dot enabled equals to false. It will just turn off. I like smartphones. I can see where someone needs to marry. Hey, Carol. <laughs> Without reading your name, I knew it's you. Strange, isn't it? Let's see if this actually happens. So if I go, if I get too close, the phone just dies. Yoink. That happened. I mean that was not startling or anything. That's the problem I have right now. But that's 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 something.
Uh, there we go. Yoink. Not white. It should be black. Why is it white there? Yoink. Gonna play Minecraft. Do so, Nicolini. I will also end the stream in like five minutes or so. It's almost been three hours. This is fun. Like, we're, we're creating something. We're creating something big. It's not really big yet. We're on the way. It's, it's, it's happening. It's happening, guys. It's happening. Let's see it again. Let's go to the lake. Let's see. We see this in the distance, right? And we, we think like, what? What's this? And I'm like, boink! And we're like, uh, what? Our phone light needs to be more in the center because if I want to grab something, it's annoying if it's on the right there. No, this is definitely not going to be bigger. <laughs> Uh, I want my phone. No, player, phone. Has to be pointing a little bit more to the left. I should be pointing more to the left, but no, I can't make it because then I can't read the stupid thing anymore. And let's just change the light. I don't care. Something like this, so the light is more in the middle, in the center. It doesn't change shit. I mean, now we're holding the phone differently, but ah, who cares? Check my Twitch too. I'll do so. Wait, let me just. I'll click on it right now. I'll check it out later. Uh, I can add friends. I added you as a friend. Hey! Wow, that's fast. We're freaking fast. Yoink and phone just off. Like what? It's still not in the center. I want it in the center. Let's let's do that a second here. Uh, let's not maximize this on play. Six hundred and sixty-six coins. Did I turn it on today? I think I didn't turn it on. I'm sorry. I completely forgot to turn it on. Uh. Wait, no. Yoink. I mean, now it's not really correct, but that's okay. Make the spot angle bigger. Distance a bit less. Should be fine now. Let's see. Uh, yoink. A yoink. Oops, that's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. <laughs> I'm just taking the wrong things right now. Uh, player. No, the player itself. No. Is it just the camera? What? Like this? Oh, okay, good. Something strange. I changed something strange here, but that's stupid. Do we always see our head now? We always see our head now. Look at this, we see this ominous head just floating around. Perfect, that's what I wanted, shit. Uh, camera? No, the camera should not be rotated at all. The head needs to be rotated. Does it? I broke everything, I broke everything! I didn't break shit, but I broke everything! <laughs> Okay, now it's good. Now we're good. We're good again. God damn it. Be 
We need to fill the roads. Yeah, of course, there's gonna be stuff here. Wait, why are we so small now? Why are we so small? Yoink. Why are we so small now? I shit, I broke things. I should not have touched anything here. But that's okay. I broke things, I will repair those. Uh, repairs can be made off stream. Cause right now I will also call it a day. I've been going for three hours straight or what? Uh, no, two, a little bit over two hours, that's okay. Um, yeah. I will fix this, I will continue streaming this because I'm having fun, you have good inputs and it's just great overall. So we're on a, on a, on a progress there. On a progress, we, I became a halfling. <laughs> So for now, I will call it a day. Thank you guys for joining. Enjoy your evening. Join the next time around. And uh, yeah, stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you the next time around. Bye-bye.